Hello everyone, I'm Greycloak, thank you for joining me, and welcome back to episode 17 of Factorio with the Space Age expansion, where we have just, I think, at least finished building our bus to the point where we are just going to make a robot mall now. I might be wrong about that, but at least we're going to start the robot mall and then we will build anything we don't already have afterwards. Or oh, that is the plan at least. So, we're just going to get started, I think. Are we going to bring all of these in close? Are we just going to store them out here? Close would be better, right? Can't really go under all of these, though. How are we going to fix that? Could just not build where they are, I guess. Also, I want these further out here because I always end up having all the resources in one location and then the build extending far away from that. So I'd rather try to have it somewhat centered in regards to what I'm trying to build here. So if that is the full width of what we're building, this seems fine. Power everything. Oh, we should have robopods. Dismantle everything. And our first robot. Good. So for things like iron, we use two chests. Same with cover. Same with steel. Same with gear wheels, I think. Maybe we actually just do that for everything. Green circuits as well. Everything so far, at least. Hmm. Don't know where these go right now. And I said I wouldn't build where we had those. Which means... These need to go there, these need to go here. We need to make more passive providers. And then this goes here instead. And we need more power poles. Okay. How about we want in here? If we just change the length of these these slightly, we have a good amount of space between them for these if that is what we want to do now we're moving them quite far over though hmm. oh well now we want these on the steel and then we want gear wheels over here
Good. And then brick here. Green circuits. I think coal is fine just being one thing. One build. And plastic as well. Brick should also be okay like that, I guess. So that's this one, right? Brick, green, coal, plastic only. We don't want as much stuff in there. So we should take plastic and bring in there instead. Oh, we could make this green circuits, this coal. And we have red circuits coming in somewhere as well. Okay, so green circuits is this one. And then I guess we do hole here. Can we then do plastic here? Not really, we can't do do brick there either. Eh. We can if we just use the other side of this belt though. Oh, the other side of this, this lane. Oh, we're not supposed to go there. Never mind. We're supposed to go here. This is just going to get in the way of everything. Can do something like this though. Just in case we need this stuff later. Plastic and still go like this. But then we can't get anything in here anymore, so plastic should really go over here instead, like we did before. And then red circuits will be coming in here most likely, somehow. Good. Let's put red circuits out here. And we will just do this for now. Good. Let's start setting this stuff up. We need chests. And we need the upgrades, at least for the setup. This is not the full built everything setup. This is just what we need here, mostly. And this is a good place to start. I am I not hitting the right things here? Apparently not. So this is a good place to start using red belts here.
all of the inserters we need. Probably don't need long-handed inserters, but I'm still making them. Power poles. Pipe. Robopods. We need one of those right now. Maybe minus. I can handcraft these pretty easily, so I'm not going to auto or automate that. At least not yet. More places to charge would be good. We might need these. And maybe we should start requesting stuff. Which is basically the same things we're building here. We should maybe request these. Oh wait, there's a new feature. We can do sections of this, or groups. Where we can disable stuff. This could be our train group. Where we could request all of this stuff. And big electric poles. And maybe that's it for now at least. And then we can just disable it so we aren't brought stuff for it here. So we don't need big electric poles up here, because we usually only use those for trains. Underground. I would like to bring pumps around if we were doing any long pipes and stuff. I always want some of those. I probably also always want logistic butts. These, and these, and these, and these. Why not? Some of those. All of the combinators, basically. And that's it for here. Minus. Electric furnaces and assembling machines. For now, this will just be tier 2. Chemical plants, beacons, modules, good. We can also add a trash section to trash everything we don't want. Whoops. And then we don't have to just built that in here by adding a bunch of rows and then adding it later. So yeah, we will move add more here as we get to it. Though I guess we could do everything right now actually. Uh, plate is not really true. We don't want to get rid of that. Plastic though is true. Don't want solid fuel either. I don't want petroleum. No, sorry, sulfur. Batteries is usually also an annoyance. Same with explosive. Carbon. Copper wire. These. Engine units. Electric engine units. Probably these as well. 
we will just disable this whenever we actually need some of this stuff. Should we also add these? Not right now. If they start to annoy us, we add them. Good. That is most of the trash from in here. From here, do we want to actually request anything? Not right now, at least. From here. Not right now either. Okay. So, moving on here. We got to these, but we didn't actually build assembling machines for some reason. I will make tier 3 here, and I will make the modules for them. And again, I am forgetting about iron sticks. And... Cover wire. Let's just make two of those and two times cover wire. How do we not have red circuits yet? Because they're all being taken here. I got it, I think. Yes, okay. So now we have red circuits. I think we also made beacons as well. Just because I want them around a rocket silo at some point. Good. Now then, what do we actually need? Mm. Again, what is our goals? Science, which we haven't gotten yet, because we need to craft a big electric mining drill. And that took some molten iron. But we won't do that right now. Because <laughs> I'm lazy. But then what's the point? We need this for science. Science requires tungsten stuff. Okay. We might still do that stuff as a normal bus build and not as a robot build. And then just add it to the network. Same with science. Now I'm not sure if we actually need to do anything here. But at least we got everything automated that we want. And we can make some storage chests. Oh, I guess we should actually try to use this somewhere. It isn't that we're using these very fast, it's just that we can have a bunch. Okay. The rest is just going here for now. I 
and we get some of this stuff automated. I was talking about actually putting concrete on the bus, or at least building it on the bus. Maybe that's still worth it. Or we could just robot everything. Do we have a foundry? No. If we want to do everything with robots, we still need to know how big foundries are and how much space we need to reserve for it. Three of those, we can get more. You need carbon. There was a way to make carbon, right? Coal and sulfuric acid. We should make that as well. Things that are as simple as that, I don't feel like doing with robots. Just to bring the coal in and then output the tungsten carbide, but maybe we should just do it. So if we wanted a fluid robot build here, we need space for inserters and output. So we could do this on one side and potentially just have space for this on the other side. then that is the space we would need to reserve for all fluids. And then there's some fluids you need two, two of. So we can't really just do one build fits all. We need to just reserve some space and hope for the best. Or we could build stuff down here now. We could also scale everything up, but... Well, maybe that should actually be the priority. These belts look sad. But I would like to be able to automate the production of foundries. And that is why I'm trying to do this stuff. So... Do we need lubricant for anything else than foundries? Maybe we do some belt, maybe we do some electric engine units. But that is all still made, I thought, in an assembling machines. But it's apparently very good turbo underground stuff, or turbo belt stuff is done in foundries. Okay. So we do reserve this amount of space. Just one side of a, a one side of the pipe really. Where was our lubricant? Right here. I can make foundries and foundries as well. But I don't really think I need that speed. I think we just needed this for the reserved space. We built down here before. Are we not allowed to do the same now? Yes, we are. So you 
and request everything for a foundry. But you don't have everything for a foundry. We need to automate some more stuff. But we can't build any further to the right than here, and I want this base for fluid stuff. Maybe I was right on point the first time and where I said I would build this stuff down here. We could also just do concrete and stuff down here. We need brick for concrete, so this stuff. But that can honestly go in both directions, no problem. And that seems like a good idea to me. And then we want stuff to go here. Concrete. Refined concrete, maybe. This doesn't have to be perfect. Still doing this in assembling machines, I think. No, because then we needed iron ore. We will do it in a foundry, because then we have molten stuff. It doesn't really have to line up with anything. So we're just doing this. Good. Could easily have done this up here anyway. No, let's not. It's going to annoy me too much. One solid input, one solid output. Lacking molten iron now. Now we shouldn't lag it anymore, I don't think. As long as these are running. Also, we need to be able to get rid of this stone stuff. Would have been nice to get in here, but we can also just upgrade this, I guess. Okay. Problems gone, I think. We only have four of these. That's only slightly more than one of them can produce. This is about half what one can produce. And this is actually quite a lot. 10 per second. Ninety per second. So it isn't really that much, no. This should start building up again then. We need brick in here. And then concrete out there. This can make. Oh, we also need water. And water is in the way of everything. Everything is in the way of water, I guess. 
we misused this so it won't really be full, I guess. Then we make 10 concrete every 10 seconds. No. Wait, what? 10 concrete every 10 seconds, but with a crafting speed of 4. Somehow gives us 6 per second. Do we have productivity for concrete? Or is it just this machine? Productivity 50%. Is that inherent? Yes, it is. Base productivity. Okay. That's pretty awesome. Now, if we wanted to make refined concrete as well, we can't do that in these machines. Okay. How about in an assembling machine? We need water again. And other stuff. I think reinforced... Oh, refined concrete, sorry. I'm not sure why I called that reinforced. The words don't just remind me of each other, I guess. But that could just be made over here. If we do a water pipe. And again, one, two tiles for input output. You can't do anything, but this can. Refined concrete. Water pipe here. Why did we never finish this? What was supposed to be in this pipe? I don't even know. But I think I thought it was a uh, lubricant. Steel, iron sticks, and soon concrete will be in here. I think concrete just goes on this side, because now we have strayed a bit far to that side, I feel. Of course, that gets in the way of this stuff. Mm. With red underground, though, we're fine. Both these here, we can have them aligned all the way down. But then we can't reach anything. Okay. That sucks, I guess. Could we just limit these a bit? Maybe not. Well, some of them maybe. What's supposed to go in here? Red circuits? There's just some, some things I don't find useful enough to fill chests with. Like coal and plastic and brick. Mainly things I find down here in this category. Good, so now we have concrete, so now we should be making refined concrete, and we are... Ah, this may be a bit overkill. 
I just need to give it some time. Then we need tungsten carbide. And tungsten carbide is used for science as well. Wasn't that the case? Yes, along with tungsten plate. Mm. Oh, hello there. You will be dead soon, I hope. Soonish. I will get distracted so many times before that, but never mind. Um, science. I want to make a big leg, a big mining drill, simply so we don't have to look as long for the science. I just want to be able to find it here and click it. But we can find it through here for now. Need a bunch of those. We need molten cover. But this stuff can also be made over here if we want to. We know now we don't want this bus to be that big anyway. But yeah, I really want to make a big mining drill. I can get most of this. Electric mining or engine units though. We don't need that many, so they just go right here. And we need the engine units for those. Steel gear wheels done. Not making these yet because we don't have the tungsten carbide. Tungsten carbide still requires carbon, so we should automate carbon first. But this can now be removed. This is all almost disconnected now. These are not needed anymore either, so then this is not needed. This could also be torn down, but I don't want to right now. So, carbon. Coal, sulfuric acid. In what? In chemical plants. Carbon. Fluid. And this is also in the way of everything. Awesome. Oh. Something like this. Hold in. We might need more coal soon, but that's fine. We need more of everything, basically. Carbon can just go right there. And then we needed carbon for this. Do we need carbon for anything else? Carbon fiber at some point. That looks like to be on another planet though. 
and then coal. So not really, no. I don't think this sh should go to the robots then. This should just go right here. Into tungsten carbide production. That requires us to have space for tungsten yellow. So far, the only tungsten we have seen was over here somewhere, I thought. Yeah. And that's probably not going to give us a lot. Hmm. But it's fine. This is reserved for tungsten. This was just made in an assembling machine. Yep. Sulfuric acid again. Good. Oh, tungsten again. We put that there. And then we start to build these machines further and further down so we actually have extra space here. Sounds good to me. We need tungsten. Where did we store? No, we didn't store all of our tungsten. We processed it, right? Oh. Tungsten goes here for now. This comes with us to the robots. Yeah, we're making plenty of this now, so that's good. Why haven't I made one of these yet? No, not one of those. One of these. Molten iron. Oh, because of the electric engine units. We need to automate these. I really just want one to get the recipe. need more plastic. We need more s petroleum. Okay. But I really want this right now for some reason. I steal those. Then we just need molten. And we make it in a foundry. Good. Can I even just make two of these? I think we have enough for that. Oh, and we have productivity in these, so we get extra. That's pretty awesome. So now we actually don't have the recipe yet. Still need to make tungsten plate. If we steal some of this, put it in a foundry, along with molten iron. Okay. So up here again.
There we go. Then we actually have the recipe available. Good. But this is also something we have to build, obviously. And we'll probably just go right next to this. And I said I wanted to start building stuff further down, so let's do that. Input, output. How did I line this up earlier? We just went all the way in. Okay. Then it would make sense if this was actually up here. This goes next to this, and we put it on the bus. It does not go next to this. This goes on its own lane. We really need to scale some things up soon. We will put these at the ends. If we had the belt for the belt, we really need more gear wheels. It would be nice. Well, we need to upgrade the belts for anything really to be scaled, I think. If we made this in a foundry, we would get more back. Or we would get more foundries out of it than in an assembling machine. Right? Yes, because if we make two, we get three. That sounds worth it to me. We need more tungsten for us to actually produce any more over there. And that's okay. Just want one more finished of these so we get two more. Steel, go in, please. Thank you. Are you... Missing anything? Not really. We shift that over, we can have another two of these. Up 
hier. Come on. Maybe I was too early with going over to Red Belt. So, more molten iron available. We have a full yellow belt of iron here. It better output here, apparently. A yellow belt almost can't keep up a one side of yellow belt. Which means if we make one more of those. We can fill basically a full yellow belt. Which means faster production of red belt, which means faster expansion of this. Good. Steel. Can easily keep up. Can share that half of the belt easily still. And scale up easily. As long as we have the iron available. Can you please go away? Then we can run, actually get through here, because apparently chests are a solid walled entity as opposed to many other things like assembling machines. Mm. Still not a lot of belt. And that's still because of gear wheels. They are required in a lot of places, of course. Hmm. Just a bit more needed. So this is basically the most expensive part. Every one of these takes 40. Mm. Guess we will limit those a little bit more heavily. Whoops. And then we want to expand this. But we need more foundries. And for that we need, we need more tungsten. So there was nothing left here. We can take this and put in here, I guess. It is two to one. But yeah, we just have to go and find some more tungsten, I guess. Just basic tungsten ore. Unless we can just go and try and mine, but as soon as the worm gets near us, I think it attacks any building. And we can't even get one new foundry. 
Let's see if we can do some uh, simple mining, low quality, low tier mining. We do get tungsten, that's good. There isn't any way to make this, right? Gathered from ro rocks, and that's it, and big mining drills. Okay. So right now we actually don't need this stuff. So we do need to just have this here. Okay, that can just run. Let's go get rid of our raw resources here. Two more. Thank you. And then it was iron gear wheel scaling. Good. That's a lot faster than it was now. Are we lacking steel still? Pretty much. Can't have it all on one build. We need three machines for half a build, it seems. Maybe less, but we'll see. They are keeping empty now, good. And we just want another setup like that. And that's all the tungsten we got. Enough for one more, okay. Good. And we have 60% productivity here because we also have 10% steel casting productivity. So that's pretty nice. Which means we can almost get a full yellow belt out of this little setup. How are we doing on iron? Oh, molten iron though. We are getting a little bit low. So now we need to make more of these. Which means we need two more foundries. And potentially more handling of stone. Two more foundries, but that requires more tungsten. Dang it. 
feel like we're so close. But that's not really true. We're just scaling everything up. And getting closer, slowly. And what are we even close to? Being able to build a tank, we can do that right now. And then we could probably kill the... Uh, worm out there. And if we could kill the worm out there, we could actually mine the tungsten instead of doing this. So that should probably be the priority. But I am a little bit uh, lazy. I guess even though this is the least lazy, lazy thing, it is very involved. Maybe I'm just stubborn. Tungsten. Iron ore. Copper ore. Stone. Okay. How are we doing on copper? Just fine so far. We're not even using a full belt. Don't have to take that from me. We can just store that in here, it doesn't really matter. We seem to be low on iron, or molten iron now. And we are, okay. But we're waiting on the tungsten. We basically have enough for two, which is the same as three. Still making more, that's good. Okay. Three more. Oh. But I didn't make the extra room. Are we going to be okay with that? We might just need to run several belts here. Or maybe it is emptying out soonish. Not really though. So how many of the do we have here? Six. So after three we should maybe do this thing. They are emptied out now, I guess. Somewhat. This is a bit sad though for cover. 
now cover will be low because of this. So cover should really run next to this. Can we go under all of this? Nope. Cover should recover then. Hopefully. Also, it's probably going to be the next thing we scale. Good. Have enough for three more. Maybe we should do productivity modules as well. Though I guess we can put those in here anyway. It's not an intermediate we're crafting. And we can't, okay. Okay, but we have a lot better production of different things. Iron is good on my yellow build cover, or steel is good, cover, iron gear wheels, at least for now. I think we need to increase green circuit production and red circuit production. Because at least red circuits are sad. These are not sad yet. But if we scale this, they will be, or the green will be sad as well. We don't have a lot of those because of this, okay. Oh, we need uh, petroleum to scale this, though. Okay. But unfortunately, that's all we have time for in this episode. So thank you all for joining me, and I'll see you next time. Bye.